and with reports of violence in the regions surrounding Battery City. Really? You're broadcasting now? If you bleed out behind that mic, I swear. Welcome to the Wastes. This is Grim Grinner on all channels. So we found the spy that had been in the corporation. Someone named Spectre, which is fitting since they were supposed to be a ghost in the gat. And since they're now ghosted. Luckily we got a bit of information out of them just before a handful of mercs and creeps decided to blast through. Uh, I guess Spectre wasn't as well hidden as they thought and was followed. Needless to say, we're making tracks out of there fast, headed towards the med bay. I got grazed by one of those crazy corporate energy guns and it evidently did a lot more damage than I expected during the firefight. So if I pass out from pain during this broadcast, just know that we're gunning it to get tended to. <laughs> I sure took a bunch of those bastards down though. I think the remaining few hopped back in their vehicle and bailed. On the plus side, we now have one of their guns, which is pretty slick and looks like it can be charged with solar power, so that's going to come in handy. As for what Spectre was able to tell us, apparently the corporations are working to try and find Garden Town so that they can test the resources and try and enhance their AFPs, artificial food processors. So, if anyone near Garden Town or the bakery hears this, be ready, and I suggest fortifying and locking down. Spectre was pretty sure that they hadn't found any solid leads on Garden Town yet, but better be safe than sorry. If the corporations can extend their reach that far, there's no telling what they would set their sights on next. Hold on, this is gonna get bumpy! God damn, this hurts. I've cauterized the wound as best as I can, but it's still a lot of pain. Before the shootout, I was able to patch into a broadcast from Ausund. Sounds like a few more corp thugs have been found dead in an old warehouse. Sounds like the fight was pretty brutal as far as those guys were concerned. Word is they ran with a gang led by a particularly tough face in the corporation, Drake Urban. From what I've heard of this guy, he worked his way up and is pretty deadly. I don't doubt he's made quite a few enemies, and it sounds like he's got another one on the list. <laughs> fuck. Fuck, oh, fuck, oh, fuck, oh, fuck, oh, fuck! Haven't really had any survival tips lately since we're barely scraping by, but uh, I do want to make sure to get the message out. <sighs> Keep safe in the waste, everyone. I don't know if it's my broadcasts or if there's something else bigger at play here, but. The mercs and creeps are getting more volatile every day. If it hadn't been for Spectre's help and CJ getting the engine gunning, I'm pretty sure those creeps would have been the end of me. And with how far they're getting from the GAT, I think a big fight might be on the way. I don't know. I might just be delirious from the blood loss. I mean, the ferals seem to be forming bigger packs. And I've heard of a few smaller settlements and outposts being taken over by some really scary raider groups. I know there are those of us still fighting, and for the right reasons. People like this new bounty hunter, Gypsy, who apparently doesn't say much, but has been going around setting rights and wrongs wherever they get jobs. So for those who can hear me, who are still fighting, against the corporations, against raiders, against ferals. Just know that I'm not going to stop putting my voice out there for you all. <laughs> Hell, even... Uh, even with a potentially fatal wound. <sighs> Once I'm all patched up, I'll be back providing whatever advice and information I can. Corporations aren't winning this one. But... For now... I need to conserve my energy and try and do what I can to keep this wound from opening up again. We're still a fair trek from the med bay and the roads only get worse from here. As usual, this is Grim Grinner on all channels. See you in the wastes. Don't you fucking quit on me now!